infections are infections acquired in hospitals. In the USA, it has been estimated that 9.2 out of every 100 patients has a nosocomial infection. Many actions should be implemented to avoid HCAI, such as hand washing, patient preparation in the healthcare unit, and medical and surgical equipment care. But the most important is the material that the staff in hospital will use to pack the medical device, which will be steam sterilized. RJ Wiggins Healthcare, with both its divisions of Sterimed and Sterisheet, is the world leading supplier of breathable web for hospital pouch and wrap materials to be steam sterilized. Our first commitment is to bring value to our hospital pouch manufacturer partners while ensuring total patient safety. As someone working in a hospital or in a CSSD and attending a patient safety forum, you have many options. Seminars in hospital, driven and organized by our geographical partner, you will see what are the different kinds of packaging that we can use in CSSDs or hospital, what is a medical web, and what are the key performances of a good packaging material that is a barrier to microorganisms. Some tests will be displayed to help you understand the material's properties. Or attending a forum in our factory in Palauda, France. This is a good opportunity for you to understand the process of medical web manufacturing and have access to interactive meetings with people sharing their views about product experiences. This event will be a full day of talk and discoveries about material properties, consumer experiences and innovation of market. I am in charge of the sterilization center in the Hospital of Mexico, Mexico City. We get 7,000 beds for patient treatment. We are about 40 agents working in sterilization centers. We have three sterilization centers. I think that a patient safety forum could be very interesting. I would like to get informed about the manufacturing process, different operation lines, and also how you control the manufacturing of the medical web. The hospital holds 2,000 beds for patient treatment and 600 beds for surgery. We've got 30 operating rooms and we process about 20,000 surgical operations per year. 30 of our agents work in the sterilization center and that doesn't include people from the direction. All the information we can get, the better. A training is always a good way to learn. The asset of the sterilization field is every day we discover different practices and that's why we are so passionate about this field. I'd like to get informed about the manufacturing process, to get more details about porosity, and to be aware of the different ways of folding materials. Also, information about the shelf life of material. If it's possible to get a longer shelf life in order to improve the performance. The more we get information, the more it will help us do a better job. <laughs>